Thank you very much. Yes, we have a junior chef with us, Caden, who's going to help Danny with all the... Uh, Danny came up with so many amazing recipes, really. You've been amazing. Thanks. But now yes. we're on the sweet stuff, which we I are. love. So take us away. Cool. So we're going to make uh, a Dutch puff, which is like a baked pancake. Okay. So it's like a Yorkshire pudding and a pancake kind of crossed, baked in the oven. All Sounds right. good to me. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> it's your favorite dish, I know. I know. Cool. So we'll start with some eggs, maybe. OK. Right, you want to crack some eggs? Of course. Kate, you want to crack an egg yes. into that one? That would be great. Caden, you like, you like cooking, yeah, right? Sure. Yeah. That was nice. And I'm just going to make a quick batter. You better do a better job than I did, because, you know, I <laughs> do not know how to yeah, crack exactly. an egg. <laughs> one more time. One more. Yeah, You're nice. You're getting there. Good stuff. And we're nice. rocking and rolling. There we go. I'll take that one from you, big guy. Cool. You go for it. Awesome. Cool. So Brad's going to whisk those eggs up. I'm just going to make a quick, quick batter that's just all-purpose flour okay. and milk and nutmeg, a little tiny bit of salt, and a little bit of cinnamon. Salt, huh? A tiny bit. Yeah. Well, when baking, it's always have a little bit of salt, and it's, it's going to be sweet and savory, mostly okay. sweet. Okay, and you like to cook. What kinds of things do you like to cook? Egg free. Tell us about that. Uh, you get like an egg. You have to have a bread first, then put the cup in it, twist it, and it, you put it in first, then you put the bread in, then you put the egg in the bread hole, and that's how you make it. And it's delicious. Sounds good. Yeah. Nice. So now do you fold in the egg and the... Yeah, exactly. We'll go, uh, Greg, oh, do you come like on, come on Brad. Like, come on. Does it seem like I know what I'm doing here? Do you like fold in the egg now? <laughs> so the, the reason this works is because the air trapped inside the eggs makes this rise in the oven. Come on. I, I you need can... by four for this one and I don't have them right almost now. Almost there. Come almost on, there. Can you work out? I am right now. <laughs> All right, that's ready. That's okay, perfect. Right you can just dump them right in. Dump them right in. Yeah. And so the eggs are all frothy. Oh, and see? Oh, nice, 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 right? And so we're just going to fold in this, the eggs into the batter to not have it collapse. And if we were to whisk it, all the air would we'd lose the air and we wouldn't get the same kind of rise. And the key is having a nice hot cast iron pan. Yeah, for sure. Nice. Incorporate this. The batter just, just comes together. And of course, if you're doing something like this, you need butter. You got your butter right here. Uh -huh. got okay. Everything's better with butter, right? Everything. There's our batter. <laughs> like you said, so our, everything. I'll, I'll switch you. All right. All right, we got a nice hot pan. So what are we doing here? What are we going to be doing with all We're of this stuff right here? We're going to garnish this. Okay. The lovely, beautiful pastry. Absolutely. Absolutely. Like, with we've these also, guys. We have yeah. other elements here that so we need to. So butter goes in. You're going to watch this. Pan is going to be hot, but you want that heat. Ooh. And the batter goes in. Caden's going to help us with this decorating price, so stand by here. And this goes right into the oven, into a hot oven. All right, and the magic of television magic once of again. Television. Absolutely. This hot one comes out. Here comes the Dutch puff. And then we garnish it when it's hot with icing sugar. What a cool formation it makes. Huh? And it rises. It does collapse a little bit as it sits, but you get this really nice finished product that's this is fantastic. We'll get this guy think, out of Kaden? here. What do you think? Really good. Looks good. Yep. Well, good now here. the best part. And now the fun starts. We get uh, to understand so this is... what you want on it. So what are we going to hit first here? Uh, first, banana for healthy. Kind yes. of? Banana for healthy. OK, good so you put answer. as many as you want on here. I'll let you do that. Go after it. I like that. Banana for healthy. I would have gone chocolate right off the bat. <laughs> no, no, me too. It's like all over the Nutella. Sugar, sugar. No. Nice. Really healthy. So a couple bananas in there. What would you put next? Maybe a little bit of Nutella. That's my boy. That's Chocolate nice. and bananas. Absolutely. Perfect. I'll throw yeah. this one on for you. Oh, that's looking good. Uh, a little mm. switch around. Swirl it around, right? I'm yeah. swirling. Swirling. What else would you go for? Hmm. Uh, maybe some raspberries. Okay. Robin, you want to put those ones on? raspberries are good for you as well. Yeah. It's going to be a nutrient-rich chocolate. Amazingness. Delicious. Delicious. What else can I say? Yeah. Can you put whatever you want on there? Whatever, whatever seasonal you put Anything as well. Anything else? Much? What else you want? Uh, on that's this? good. That's no good cream. For you? No whipped cream. Okay, oh well, yeah, 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 whipped cream. Because you know you that's, want some whipped cream. Yogurt. That's yogurt. <laughs> oh, it's yogurt. We got us all excited. Yeah. We're gonna whipped have cream. a little oh, more bananas too. here. <laughs> I was like, one more what? bananas. One more raspberries. Oh. Ready to rock. So, you know, nice. when we come back, Caden's going to be my date, and we're going to try out everything that we made 
all this morning. So stick around. This might be gone by then. Yeah, totally. <laughs>